Welcome again to another iOS review. At, oh, review, I was going to say, and tip, but there's no tip this week, just a, another <laughs> review. Tips coming later, maybe next week. Maybe uh, next week. Another review, and we're off to the BBC. Garth, what do you got? BBC iPlayer. So wow. BBC Global, um, look, I don't know about you, but most of the shows I like that aren't Australian are from the BBC. They're very good. They are very good. So BBC iPlayer, it's a free app, and there's a little bit of free content in there. But let me tell you straight away, it's a paid-for service, okay? So there's a, it's a subscription-based thing. And it's not... Oh, I don't... I bought it. Um, 90 bucks, I think it was, for a 12-month subscription or 10 bucks a month. Something like that, anyway. Yeah, it looks like 9.49 a month or 89.99 for a year. Yeah, there you go. So I um, had a bit of a look through the catalogue and I popped down 90 bucks for the 12 months to give it a bell. Nice. And I'm actually really enjoying it um, because, of course, you can have it on as many iOS devices. My wife's enjoying it. So a lot, and I mean quite a lot of the BBC um, archive and current shows are available there. So free streaming whenever you like. Um, so you just load it up and you can stream pretty much. Like, so could you load it up BBC and stream um, Are You Being Served? Yep. I think that's in there. Right. I'm not sure, but... Um, there's certainly a lot of stuff from that sort of era. For example, all the Doctor Who, like every Doctor Who that they've got available is I'm there. sold. I'm sold. <laughs> <laughs> so it's all there. A nice thing about the app too, which um, puts it a bit over the ABC one, which is at least the ABC one's free, but a nice thing is you can download stuff to your device. You don't have to just stream. Okay, So nice. you can go in there and download a whole, like before we went away on our last holiday, I downloaded you know a couple of episodes of various shows. Yep. Um, so they're saved on the device. Nice. And um, watched them when we're away. So now it's got a couple of good good little features in it. Um, uh, more than 2,000 hours of British TV shows on demand, constantly refreshed, including 13 different genres. Yep. The, uh, and it also goes on to say, uh, explore the, a selection of free episodes in the free section. Yeah. And watch on your TV via HDMI adapter and cable or with AirPlay. Exactly. So, so you've got uh, your Apple TV, which I believe you do, my friend. I do have. I do have. Yep, you could chuck it straight to that and up on the big screen. Sweetness, sweetness. Now, high en enjoy high-quality video streaming over Wi-Fi or 3G. And browse contemporary programs. Subscribers can download programs. As Gar said, enjoy exclusive programs never before seen outside of the UK. Wow. Yeah, it is. Wow. It's, um, I, I'm really enjoying it. Yeah, as mm. I said, it's not going to be for everyone. Not everyone likes to pay for their content. Um. There's a few weird ones out here like me who do are happy to pay for the content <laughs> if I like it. Oh yeah, look if you're getting and enjoyment um, out of it, you go yeah. and, you go and pay to see a movie. Exactly. So why exactly. would you? Well, sometimes. So, so I don't know. <laughs> most of us. I don't, for some reason, I'm you know, if I pay ninety bucks once off and I've got twelve months, I'll yeah. do it. If I was having ten bucks coming out all the time, opposite to most people, I think most people are the other way around. Mm. But um, yeah, no, I chucked it down to give it a bell and. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, really nice. Good. So yeah. the latest version, or well, the last version that was out is the 30th October, which was optimised for the iPhone 5. So it is iPhone 5 optimised. Yep. Uh, now includes full use of the widescreen dis display and social media updates. You can use the Twitter global account to share with what you're watching with your friends. Of course you can. So, what, yeah. What app doesn't allow you to send it to Twitter or That's Facebook right. or something? That's so, right. So, no, the good thing, of course, with the subscription is, um, you know, if you've got multiple devices... You only obviously have to get the subscription once and then anyone can use it. Anyone on your ID can use it. Yeah, right, yeah, right. So. so as you can see there, there's a, there's quite a few selection of shows just in the graphic on the on the uh, front page there in, the, yeah. in iTunes. Yep. Um, you've got, for those on the audio, genres, science and nature, sci-fi. You've got uh, classic period, the firm, warriors, pride and prejudice. Oh, you know, all the, all the favourites. All the good old Doctor Who, there. Equator. Oh, the whole lot. I think, uh, I think the missus is watching Tess of the Devils at the moment. Yeah, the okay. Is, right. but, um, and what's the quality? So it's, H it's full? Like it's really full? good, yeah. Yeah, cool. Good Speaking stuff. Speaking as a blind person, I will have no freaking idea, but, you know, <laughs> I think it's good. No, the good thing... What you've been told, it's good. What I've been told is good. And the, the thing I like is, you know, as I said, that you can do the download. Yeah. So if you have got maybe slightly dodgy internet, you're not going to have buffering issues. Right. Um, you can set a whole heap of episodes to download, so just let them download in the background and then come along and watch them and you're not going to have any buffering because they're all there on the device. Now, as far as you're aware, when, you, when it's BBC iPlayer Global, are there other versions? I think, so BBC have their own version in the BBC, which is much more like the ABC one, so they only have the last two weeks' worth of content. Right. Um, oh, okay, It's right. a free one that they can do the last two weeks of content type of deal. So right. this, is, this is one for people outside of the UK... Yep. You know, who aren't paying their 
two dollars twenty three to the BBC every month that you know how the Oh, yeah, something they the do TV over, tax or whatever. The TV tax that yep. whatever they do over there. All right. I guess you listeners over there can tell us. But, um, and they yeah. have. They have. Yeah. We've, we had, uh, I think it was Leon. Yes, he's, he's written in and explained it go. all to us, how it all works. So, Excellent. Uh, so that's Thanks, a couple Leon. Of, that was a, a while <laughs> back now. But um, go so, back through the I don't know. Podcast. Leon, let us know. If you're out there listening, let us know. Can you guys get this version of the app over there and, and pay for it to get unlimited streaming there? Mm, good stuff. Know. All right. Thanks. Another good one. Thanks, Garth. See, See you next time. See you later. Time.